we are going to have our random drawing section. Uh, I have the random number generator up. Uh, I'm going to, hold on, let me get this to 25. We still had it on 40 from yesterday. All right, and if I hit enter, we're going to see our first number. That is 18, that is bra. I will remind you that my uh, girlfriend and her sister were the people who made these words. Um, that is 23. Um, 23 for our verb has been used already. Uh, our second choice is 13. 13 is croak. Um, all right, and our final selection is Oh, I should not have had zero as an option, um, but we will fix that. Um, so if we go to one through 25, that is 18. Um, 18 is cuddly. Uh, so I think I think this is pretty, um, pretty easy to work with. Um, wh whether it'll get flagged on YouTube as unmonetized is a completely different question, but you know, live and learn I guess so um, we're going to have our um, non racially specific gray person um, and I don't know what that is so yeah let, let's just focus on the actual um, the actual device of question so um, there are a couple different ways we could interpret the word croak um, whether this is um, a, when some someone says that someone croaked, uh, that usually means that they are no longer with us. Um, but in this case, we're saying that it is a bra and it is cuddly. Um, so maybe we can have uh, a couple different um, meanings of the word. So if we have a very, very cute little uh, frog, maybe like a tree frog, And we are drawing this out. Um, fun fact, tree frogs, when they are rubbing their stomachs, their stomach actually secretes a mucus that is somewhat like a sunscreen for them. So they are, um, they are actually protecting their body with a fluid that is created on their body. Uh, now, this tree frog, I'm going to draw it like so. Oh, I didn't want to do undo. I wanted to grab the paint bucket. Um, and then we're going to get a nice little mouth there. Now, um, as I mentioned, they do have this nice little stomach area. And um, I'll try and color this in like that. Um, that makes the makes everything not visible so I'm trying to finish that off maybe I can color this in first there we go and then kinda looks like a turtle right now but you know it's fine um, let me just get a darker color of that for the mouth and the nose and then uh, we need to uh, actually add in the bra. So to stand out, we're going to make it a purple bra. Um, don't know why I said it that way, but the frog is um, has selected its gender, I guess. Or I guess you don't have to in order to wear a bra. You can do whatever you want. Um, but it is now looking for some extra support while uh, jumping from tree to tree as tree frogs do. So there we go. Uh, now I just need to color that section in and we will finish it off here. Uh, now 
uh, I'm hoping that this is cuddly enough, um, and I'm hoping that this is cuddly enough to the point where you will be sad when I add the, the next portion of the picture in, um, because this frog has actually croaked. Um, so there is going to be um, some sort of misty frog spirit ghost um, ascending from the uh, body here. So if I color that in, then we can get uh, some misty frog eyes. And I don't think the frog would be very happy if this were happening. Um, but you know, life is life and that's what life is. So maybe it shouldn't uh, crawl into small car door cracks um, trying to avoid the rain if it wants to not be squished. Sharon. Um, so that is not finished off there. There we go. So maybe a little bit more vision over there. Um, but that is our tree frog. So I hope that this was um, enlightening on how a, a frog could wear a bra. And uh, I hope that you guys enjoyed the entire stream. Uh, we did have a full stream today, almost an hour. Um, so if you have any questions about anything that has been mentioned, please feel free to leave those in the comments of this video and I will get to them. I'm planning on probably doing some more sections of this um, Florida Waterbirds uh, talk just because I want to make sure that I can cover adequately the um, the frequent, frequently asked questions in the Florida water bird culture, um, whether that be what is that white bird in that tree or why is that bird so big and, and things like that. So I think that it's, it's what the people want and I'm going to try and give the people what they want. Uh, so um, I'm going to be signing off. I don't know if there's going to be anything tomorrow, probably not, just because I haven't organized it already, and I have a concert I'm going to, and uh, hopefully we will have a cover um, on Tuesday, but it's kind of just if I can get something that I feel like I am confident in um, performing. I don't want to sell anything short um, here on the channel, so uh, that's going to be it. Thank you guys for watching, and thank you, Leon, for asking questions in the chat. It's always nice to have some participation. Um, but until Tuesday or the next time I stream, I am going to be signing off, so goodbye.